Looking for cute handmade gift ideas? Here are five beginner-friendly things you can crochet. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas Everywhere you go I'll link the patterns on my Instagram Take a look at the five and ten crocheting Christmas gifts. Here are some of my favourite crochet patterns at the moment that would make perfect presents. The Heartstopper Scarf by Katie Jones Knit is just so dreamy and also really quick to work up. Devout Hand created this sausage dog scarf which looks cute in every colour and perfect for your dog obsessed pals. And then for your friends that love a bonnet like I do, this loose ruffles balaclava by Fran Make Stuff is one of my favourite things to make.
Your Honor, <laughs> Your Honor, I'm slang. <laughs> <laughs> you won't finish your Christmas crochet gifts on time, I'm going to show you how to make a little IOU package to let your loved ones know their gift will be ready in the new year. You'll need a gift bag, scrap card, scissors, darning needle, scrap yarn, a crochet hook, a pen and this tutorial. We're going to make our gifties a crochet heart like this one. I'm using Aran weight yarn with a 4mm hook but you can use whatever you like. First, make a slip knot. Then, chain 4. In the fourth chain from the hook, aka the first chain you made, we're going to make three treble crochets. You'll do this by yarning over your hook twice, going into the stitch and pulling up a loop, yarning over and pulling through two loops on your hook and doing the same two more times. Remember, I'm using US terms and if you're struggling with the stitch, there's lots of tutorials on YouTube to follow. Into that same stitch, we're doing four double crochets, yarning over, inserting your hook and pulling through, yarn over, pull through two loops and yarn over and pull through two more loops. And to finish this half of the heart, we're going to do one more treble crochet into that same stitch again. Now we're going to do the reverse of what we just did, essentially mirroring the other side. First, we'll make four double crochets into the same stitch. Then we'll make three treble crochets into the same stitch. You should now have something that looks like this. To finish, we're going to chain three and slip stitch into the center stitch. Then you can cut the working yarn and tie off. I like to tie a knot to secure and you'll want to leave these ends long for later. Now it's time for the label. Cut out a label shape from your card, making sure it's big enough to write a message onto it. Once you've done this, you'll need to pierce a hole at the top. I like to use a blunt darning needle because you can then thread one of the ends through from your heart and tie this onto your note. Wrap this up or pop it in a gift bag. You could even add some sweets or other little gifts. And that's your crochet Christmas present IOU. Happy crochet gifting! I decided to make all my Christmas presents this year instead of buy them, so let me show you what I'm working on. We got a lot of stuff. Okay, so here's the first blanket out of three. And this one is done. This is a second blanket and it's still a work in progress. It's gonna be really big. This is the third blanket, it's also done. Now for the sweaters, this is a granny square hexagon cardigan. It's for my grandmother and yellow is her favorite color. I'm almost done with it, I just have to weave in the ends and do the trim. This is my favorite thing that I've made. This is a hexagon granny square sweatshirt. So here's the hood and I'm almost done with it. I just have to finish like the trim on the bottom. And then I started this yesterday. It's half of a hexagon sweater. So it looks like that. And then I have a hat and matching gloves and I have one more hat. And then I have like three more things that I haven't even started yet. So hopefully I finish them by Christmas. <laughs> all of it's crochet. And I know people are gonna ask me for patterns and stuff. I'm so sorry to tell you that it's all just like freehand. Like I kind of just made it up as I went. It's December 26th and I promised myself that I would crochet presents for my friends by January 2nd. Ronnie, I'm starting with you. Hope you like it, Ronnie. Julia, you're next. Make some tabby mittens with me on my commute. I'm using some cotton yarn I have left over from another project in a cream color and this pink speckled yarn. I think they kind of look like cake together. I got on the train at 8.54 a.m. and started the ribbing as I'm working from the wrist up. I finished the wrist part at 9.39 a.m. and then I didn't record me making all of this because someone asked if I crochet and then cue a 40 minute conversation. On the train home, it took me just over an hour to finish the main glove and get started on the first thumb hole. I'm really happy with how these are looking and can't wait to see what they turn out like. This is it styled, but I don't plan to wear it with anything necessarily. I just made it because I thought it was cute, to be honest. This is what the back looks like. Again, it covers everything. This is another mini skirt of mine, and compared to the one that I did before, they're about the same size, so... Ich lerne Deutsch!
die.